welcome back to Celebrity Jeopardy. Because of what happened just before the commercial, I'd like to apologize to all blind people and children. That said, let's take a look at the scores. Robin Williams has set a Jeopardy record by buzzing in 2,000 times and never answering a question. Yes, thank you. Yes, Jeopardy, yes. I hear you, my boy. You are healed. We have found Tom Selleck's mustache, yes. So let me go over here and look at the scoreboard. What do you have here? Oh, Vanna White. Can we turn the letters? She's making a vowel movement, yes. Oh, hi, I'm Robert Downey Jr. Robert Downey Jr. wants a recount, yes. And he's a kid at home going, No, I want to read Harry Potter. Yes, fantastic. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Moving on, Catherine Zeta-Jones has no score at all because she's mostly been talking about her recent marriage. Alex, I'd like to say hello to my new baby and wonderful husband. Michael, darling, if you're watching, the diaper's in the bedroom closet and the baby's diapers are under the sink. I love you, darling. That's beautiful. And finally... Sean Connery is also here. Let's move on to Double Jeopardy, where the categories... Not so fast, Trebek. I really thought that was going to work. Well, you were wrong, you Montebank. I pose a conundrum to you. A riddle, if you will. I don't want to hear it. What's the difference between you and a mallard with a cold? One's a sick duck. I can't remember how it ends, but your mother's a whore. <laughs> Wonderful. Let's take a look at the categories. They are potent potables, point to your own head, letters or numbers, will this hurt if you put it in your mouth, an album cover, make any noise, and finally, famous Muppet Frogs. I should add that the answer to every question in that category is Kermit. Thank you. Yes, Kermit. Yes, it's like Kermit and John Wayne going, it's not easy being green, pilgrim. It's like Schwarzenegger, yeah, I'm Kermit the Frog. Yeah, that's me, Schwarzenegger Kermit. Boy, you, boy, you might be legally retarded. <laughs> he has a point. All right. Catherine Zeta-Jones, we'll start with you. I'll take giraffes for a billion. Let's just go with letters or numbers for 200. And the answer is five. Is five a letter or a number? The number five, is it a number? Mr. Williams. Oh, it's a beautiful thing, yes. Right now, as I got home going, what the hell is going on there, man? Why don't you check Thank that? you. Thank you. <laughs> Mr. Williams, you already rang in. Yes, it's a beautiful thing, though. Monica Lewinsky's at home going, Thank ah! you. Thank you. Anyone else? Mr. Williams, I hate you. But I love you. It's like Jesse Helms and Michael Jackson going, You cannot talk about Yes. You are a very sick man. Anyone besides Mr. Williams? Five is, of course, a number. <laughs> Catherine Zeta-Jones, sadly, it's still your board. I'll take TV shows that did stories about my wedding for 300. For the last time, that is not a category. <laughs> Sean Connery, why don't you pick? Well, the game is afoot. I'll take anal bum cover for 7,000. <laughs> Anal bum cover. I can read Trebek. That says anal bum cover. I spent five years of my life trying to invent an anal bum cover. Failing to do so is my greatest regret. <laughs> you have led a horrifying life. The category is an album cover, and the answer is the Beatles' white album is this color. Catherine Zeta-Jones. Who are the Beatles? I'm sorry, that's wrong. No, I'm asking you, who are the Beatles? I've never heard of them. 
Oh, yes, the Beatles, yes. What if they're, what if they're the Volkswagen Beatles, yes? Then they'd be in the back seat going, I want to hold your fire pig nougat, yes. For the love of God, shut your mouth. <laughs> I tell you what, let's just go to Final Jeopardy. And the category is, you know what? You guys just decide. You each ask your own question and then answer it. There's no way you can get this wrong. Because you're asking the question. Ask yourself anything at all and then answer it. You'd have to be the dumbest people in the world to mess this up. And now let's see how you manage to mess it up. Robin Williams wrote yes. nothing because he stuck his pen through his own hand. Yes. Yes, you know, it's like, suddenly it's like a Shakespearean, a Shakespearean ex who was gay going, Ah, that's poor York, I knew him well. Oh, oh, shells butts. Yes, oh. Don't ever come here again. <laughs> Catherine Zeta-Jones asked herself this question. What sound does a doggy make? <laughs> Fine. And you answered. <laughs> you didn't know the answer. You couldn't answer your own question. It was hard. Unbelievable. And finally, Sean Connery asked himself, okay, I, I think I know where this is going. Let me just see here. Yeah, yeah, that's a horse having sex with me. Okay. That's beautiful. Uh, come on, you pansy, let the people see my work. No, we're not going to do that, okay? I quit again. Good night. Come on.